AI team, the, the City Intelligence Lab. Today is our um, last uh, internship day. And so we want to summarize a bit what we've learned, what we've done and um, what we, yeah, on what, which project we worked in the last five to six months that we're here. We are really, really uh, grateful to have this program in the City Intelligence Lab. Uh, this year's team was again very interdisciplinary from different countries, from different backgrounds. From informatics to civil engineering and to bring to bridge together the different expertise in one common goal, more or less. Uh, from the concept, it's about going from a um, large scale, from a large urban scale, down to generating building volumes to make volumetric stuff. Together with my colleague Julia, we worked on a, a web app for the urban development area Aspen Seestadt. Um, it's an interactive platform where you can gain information about the area. We have uh, like point of interest, we have um, transit, we have also land use. So for each uh, layer we've built uh, certain graphs. We also calculated some indicators about land use diversity, accessibility of urban transport stations, mm -hmm. shops and services, and so on. You just go to the, to the browser and um, type in the link, and then you, you can find our web app. And test their scenarios, and just see around what's better, what's not. I was responsible for creating parametric models for urban blocks. Mainly I used Grasshopper for modeling and also doing the analysis of those blocks. For example, um, I used uh, infrared uh, decoding spaces and uh, hops and ladybug trying to find a way how to connect um, 3D uh, data as a script from Grasshopper to other APIs. Mainly I work with Grasshopper and uh, with the Ladybug, uh, Butterfly and as well Infrared plugin. Uh, I simulate some uh, CFD modeling and I try to uh, compare the result uh, of Butterfly with Infrared. So I can see the, the difference between the two results of these plugins. So I'm in charge of dashboard. So I manage working um, dashboard uh, within within Python in package. And dashboard has three steps. The first step is data cleaning and then how to and how to handle the missing values and the outliers and so on. And the second step is the modeling. So we are focus on unsupervised machine learnings. And the third the third is the validation. So we use the different quantitative studies test to validate if the model is good or need, or need to be improved. Amazing colleagues, four, four, amazing, in, um, four amazing ladies. And they were like really diverse and they were helping me. I really recommend it. So we had the opportunity uh, to explore the stuff that we really want to learn. In that way, it was a very flexible environment uh, pushing us towards what we really want. In the internship, we had the possibility to work in the lab, but also from home. So it was really flexible. Um, that was an advantage if you're like me, that still wants to have one or two courses um, done at university. You are allowed to make a mistake. You are allowed to uh, gain experience during these mistakes. And I guess this is a big achievement. It's really uh, outstanding the work that's been developed, and I hope that they take some of that in the future career paths and, and continue to develop cutting-edge applications like the ones that they're developing here in the City Intelligence Lab. Mm -hmm.